Hello! Um, today I'm going to do a little what's in my bag tag. All updated because, um, why not? I brought the Lulu Guinness um, red nose day bag the other day. Mine's the kitty cat one with the nose because it's a red nose day. And there you go. Lulu Guinness red nose day. Um, this still has the tags on and everything because I don't want to throw away a Lulu Guinness tag even if it is for Red Nose Day. It's like Lulu Guinness. Um, you can pick these up in Sainsbury's for £5 um, and there are a couple of other stars. I think there's a Russian doll and an, a stripy one or a spotty one or something. Um, but since I don't live by Sainsbury's I got my mum to pick this up for me. Um, and she knew I'd really like a cat one because I'm missing my cats. And there's a lot of junk in here already, even though I've only had it for like two days. Um, but it's because I love it to work and back and just everything gets thrown in there when I need something. Because it's big so I just go, oh yeah, just throw it in the back. Um, so I'm just going to pull out at random everything that's in there. First thing is an Asda bag. And inside the Asda bag the biggest bag of mini eggs I've ever seen. Um, 360 grams of delicious mini egg yumminess. Um, so yeah, those are nice. Obviously from Asda. Um, I've obviously been to Asda some other point during the week because there's another bag in there. There is, oh there's four Maltesers left in here. Must have been hungry at work. Lady products. We all have lady products in our bag. Um, this is my purse from Primark. Um, I quite like this. Monochrome, a bit of bow. Flaps. Top for all my non-existent money in that side. So that's where you should put your notes. I have a feeling I've shoved it all in this side because it doesn't open anymore down the corner, which is annoying. Oh yes, there's some notes in here. But here's all my receipts and money and glorious stuff. Um, mostly just receipts. Um, this is another bag with stuff in it. Right, yes, this is another bag. This one has polos in. Lots of polos. I've just thrown a packet on the floor as well. Um, oh, now it smells all minty. Then I have the uh, Miss Sporty Dr. Balm. I kind of carried this around with me now because it's a really nice lip balm. Apart from I've smushed the top of it in the lid. Not good. Um, but yeah, it's a really nice lip balm actually. Um, then I have some extra strength painkillers. And these ones are for migraines and period pains. Um, yeah, they're just like extra strength. And then I have the Impulse um, Body Fragrance, the Roses and Grapefruit one. Really like this one of these. Um, it's one of the new... Mm. It's one of the new um, ones that are on the adverts, you know, they've had like a, not a rebrand, but they've had like new scents from like experts in fragrance. Um, so yeah, that's one of those. My Falafax is in here um, to keep me up to date of where I'm going and everything like that. So today is my day off from work and tomorrow I'm in at half past ten in the morning. Joy. Um, so that's that. Um, more receipts. More receipts. What's that? Receipts and chewing gum. Essential. Um, a half eaten roll of polos. Soothers. Because, you know, everyone gets a sore throat. Uh, two bags of balsam Kleenex. Um, these are the Meant funny ones because I had a cold not that long ago. Um, an old buzz ticket with a McDonald's deal on the back. Probably won't use it. Um, sunglasses. Because the other day, believe it or not, even though it's trying to snow right now, it was sunny the other day. Um, heat packs for when I get bad back and shoulders at work and lady problems. They always come in handy. 
um, the most amazing cream in the world, um, Simple Derma Intensive Relief for dry skin and eczema. And I will have a review on these products soon, because um, Simple sent them to me. And I used them before and they were the only thing that ever like properly worked on my eczema. And as you can see, it's gone off my arms. So it clearly works. Um, another Asda receipt, what did I buy? Some Tropicana, some chicken dipper things, two jack of cake rolls, some coke, and whatever Sage Jumbo is. I don't know. Whatever it is, it costs £1.99. Sage Jumbo. Don't know what you are. Keys for work, for opening up. A big pen. I swear this is the last little bit. Um, I don't know what that is from. Oh, I do. I know what that is. That is from when I sent something out in the post the day and you have those peely strips and I just sort of shoved it in the back. Um, 50p, 20p, 5p and a button. Um, so that is the contents of my bag. Lots of fun in there. You can see that I am a messy person and I'm just going to put all of this back in, including the rubbish. Um, more pieces you can go in, you can go in, you can go in. Um, and the rest I shoved on the floor. Um, so that is my bag contents and um, yes, Red Nose Day bag, Lulu Guinness, £5, it's a bargain. Um, Lulu Guinness bags cost millions and this one didn't. Um, so yeah. Lily again is back, five pound, red nose day, all for a happy cause. You get a lovely kitty bag and you can shove it full of lovely things like mini eggs and Maltesers and polos. Um, so, yes, um, I will see you all soon in my next video. If you like this makeup look that I have going on, there is a tutorial for it. And my nails are the, um, what are they called? Instant effects, the metallic -y ones, the silver one I've got on. Looks good. Except it's scratched already. It's gonna focus on the scratch. Probably not. There we go. See, it looks scratched already. Not that good. Um, I bit of the you probably heard a lot of jingling. It's my Alice in Wonderland theme necklace, little bunnies and clucks and hats and keys and stuff. Um, so yeah, that's that. I will have an outfit post on um, in the description box below for my blog. You know how this works, why not? And I'll see you all soon. Bye!